Hello, Alexander. How are you doing? I'm good. Thank you. So how has the past three days been for you? Uh, actually, uh, this is my first day. I arrived only yesterday, but it's pretty impressive. I see a lot of people and I'm very glad to, to be here because uh, Reddington is our key partner in the, regi in the region and all this, and uh, we are very pleased uh, they present us here. So you know the theme of Jitex 2016 is reimagining realities, right? So how is a trip light reimagining reality? You know, uh, 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 the modern life is very fast, you know, and uh, we see a lot of changes. And these changes are driven by the trends in the industry. We see that virtualization and uh, service-oriented architecture and uh, data explosion in the world, they're changing IT infrastructure. And uh, we are trying to adapt to this trend and uh, we are trying to offer new products, you know, because actually Triplight is offering a wide range of products that covers all, all possible requirements uh, needful for data center. Actually, it includes uh, equipment for uh, uh, for distribution, power distribution, uh, power management, cooling solutions, and um, and UPS part as well, of course. And as you truly said, you know the market is becoming completely serv service oriented, right? So how has Triplied, you know, journeyed from say from solutions to services? Uh, actually, uh, we rely on our partners because our. Uh, main strategy is working with our partners and we are offering the complete set of products and they can build solutions and servers and services around it and in particular it concerns three-phase equipment where we are selling modular systems and uh, we'll be ready to present new products very soon actually in the nearest uh, prospect and uh, maybe Darwin will cover this part for new products. Hi, I'm Darwin Haynes. Uh, I think it's important to note that as service becomes important, our ability to support our channel partners becomes equally important, almost critical. So we try to uh, create a level of intimacy with them that allows them to understand what we can offer them so that as they go out and provide service, which is critical to their customers' uptime, that they know that they have a strong, uh, strong vendor behind them. As Alexander mentioned, new products, uh, 20, 25 years ago, we were nothing but UPSs. Now, um, UPS uh, continues to grow as a part of our business, but it represents, as a business, about 40% of what we do. Our other product lines have taken over most of, uh, most of our space with our partners, and uh, along those lines, as we, as we add par products to our portfolio, we're looking to create a solution set, um, which of course we use our partners to deliver to the end user. Um, new products that we're working on bringing out uh, are extensions to our three-phase product line, uh, both non-modular and extensions to our modular line uh, that allow us to, to, uh, to address the increasing power density that we see in the computing world today. Um, also adding to our three our, our PDU product line, power distribution units, uh, addressing critical use nodes in that lineup as well. So we, uh, we have a dynamic uh, product development function inside our organization and there will be uh, a, a continued presence in our, in our new product introduction in the region. So how does the 2017 market to talk like to you, like uh, like you, you would be focusing on any uh, new channel partner program or any new portfolio would be added uh, to your organization. How does the entire market look like to you? Uh, the market's uh, in a in a pretty dynamic uh, dynamic stage right now. There have been, uh, if you look country by country, there are, are of course challenges every year, and, you know, and and that I think 2017 will be no different. You know, there will be pockets of strength and there will be pockets of of, uh, of challenge and uh, we look at it as an opportunity to try to address specific needs in the marketplace. So I see that uh, you know, certain markets in the region have increased their, uh, their presence. We see more activity, we see projects that were uh, perhaps delayed that are now moving forward. So we, we're quite optimistic. You know, there will always be challenge, <clears throat> but the reality is, is that 
the world requires uh, consistent, reliable computing capabilities. So, you know, that's going to that's going to pull the market forward, and we will be there to uh, to underpin it and support it. Thank you, gentlemen. Thank you so much for your time. I wish you all the best for the rest of two days. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you.